You can have the perfect diet. You can even have the perfect sleep schedule. You can have a community of loving people around you. You can have a purpose in life. You can have all these things. But if you're not conscious, if you're not aware, none of it matters. I feel like everyone has like this amazing story. They had like this one type of life that was very set in stone. Then there was like this one event that happened and then they just changed completely and went to a different direction. My story is not like that at all. Like I've been going like this, I've been going around, I've been going in loops. I've been all over the place. And um, I also don't feel like I've had like this awakening as you know, I've heard other people say like they had like this one moment where it just clicked for them and they became a different person. I've never had that. Like I like to think that I did when I listened to The Power of Now the first time and it opened my eyes to the fact that we only have this present moment and that the past and the future are just delusions. They don't exist. They're not, there's nothing tangible about the past and the future. You feel that it gets you high for a couple of weeks just by understanding that. But it also gets you high a couple of weeks by understanding other things, such as the fact that you're a visitor on this earth. You are in the world, but you're not of the world. That's another crazy revelation. You know, then there's, you know, a thousand other revelations you get in your life, but none of these are necessarily your grand awakening. Just like quitting smoking and quitting bad habits is actually the easiest things in the world. The only reason why these things are perceived as being hard is because we have our egos. Our egos are craving admiration and respect. And what's the best way to do it? Make it look difficult to achieve easy things. And better yet, find an easy way to achieve something difficult and then make it look hard to everyone else. And whenever someone is coming up to you and they are like, wow, respect, man, it must have been so hard for you to quit smoking. You're like, yeah, it was. That's what people are doing. That's why the Ellen Carr method is not more popular than it is. That's why no one is talking about consciousness and how important that is for your life. Being conscious is something you can do right now. There's nothing else to it. Just be here right now. That's the optimal human diet. Thanks for watching.